the color just left the building. As a matter of fact, the color didn't even show up to the party, so. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, my name is Shemaine and I do lipstick swatches. Today, I'll be doing another swatch video for Rare Beauty by Selena Gomez. So this is her lip and cheek duo. And I want to actually wear this out today. I have somewhere to be later. Uh, I'll just be doing like a quick makeup so I can apply the blush and of course the lipstick right after. So yeah, I just did my eyebrows real quick. I have moisturizer on. I have primer on. This is from ColourPop. It's the Pretty Fresh Hydrating Hyaluronic Acid Primer. I find this to be pretty nice. I have pretty dry skin. So I typically find a moisturizing primer to help with my dryness. And for my foundation, I will be using the Maybelline Dream Radiant Liquid Hydrating Foundation. And this is in the shade 125. I don't really wear a lot of makeup these days. Like this is literally what I do. Just like quick little pumps. Next up, I'm just gonna put on a little concealer. And this is from ColourPop as well. It's their Hyaluronic Creamy Concealer. And that's pretty much it. Like I said, I have not been wearing a lot of makeup. I just don't see the need to right now. And now we can apply our blush. So this blush is called Bliss. And like I said, it's from Rare Beauty. That's what it looks like on the back of my hand. From what I've seen from other YouTube channels, you only need like a little bit to get the blush going. So I'll put a dot there and a dot there and just blend it out with my hands. Hmm. That's um, I don't know if I can see it though. I'll put one more dot there, one more there. Oh man, I don't know if I can see anything. <laughs> it's just disappearing on my face. Okay, let's just do one more dot. Maybe that's too much, huh? I feel like it's disappearing. Like, I need a little bit more. Okay, I think you can see a little better, but like I had to really go in with the color. I might need a darker blush color. That's what I did not want to get that ashy look. But I just want to put a little powder on. So this Finishing powder is from Pretty Vulgar. I got this like in a boxy charm. Don't know how long ago, but I still use it. So I'm just gonna apply a little powder just to set this. I don't know, I feel like I look ashy. Anyways, I just wanna put a little color on my lid. So this is the Crown Pro palette. As you can see, this is pretty much the palette I use every single day. <laughs> I also got this in a boxy charm. That's the thing. I don't wear like a lot of makeup. I mean, I'm big on lip products, just not like makeup. I commend those who have the time and the patience to put on a beat, but that's just not for me. Like the less product I use, the better. Cause I just don't like the feeling of like heavy makeup on my face as well. So um, my go-to look is just something really simple. And you guys can see that in my videos. Like I pretty much have the same look in every video. 
nothing changes. So the last thing that we're going to put on is the lipstick. And this one is in the shade Thankful. How nice. So tiny. This is so moisturizing. Yum. There's no particular scent to it. Mmm. I love this. I also swatched her lip souffles, her other lipsticks, in a previous video, so you guys can go check that out. I'm very interested to see how these are these. This is a lip balm or a lipstick. They feel like a lip balm. Lip and cheek two piece mini duo. I think it's a, yeah, it is a lipstick. It feels so much like a lip balm. Hmm. Well, I know this is not gonna last very long, but we'll see how it performs for the rest of the day. This is what I'll be wearing. Let us do a time check. It is 4.08 p.m. I should be back around 10 p.m. tonight, and then I will do a check-in of the blush as well as the lipstick but to be honest I can't really see the blush I can't see it so I don't know we'll see how it goes I'll see you guys later hey guys I am back and guess what I found out that the lipstick is not actually a lipstick it was a lip balm I was right the first time so it's actually there in itty bitty tiny print that says dewy lip balm and I missed it and I knew it felt like a lip balm at first but I was like well maybe it is a lipstick because I can't see anything about a lip balm on the lipstick on the packaging nor on the box so I was a little confused but now that we have established that it's a lip balm this is what it looks like right now. Let me do a time check for you. So it's 9.59. So it's 10 p.m. and I put this on around 4. So it's been 5 hours since I've had this lip balm on my lips. And it feels so good. Just like the lipsticks, my lips are left feeling hydrated. Crusty Lips 2020 is out the door. I'm looking forward to 2021. This lip balm is amazing and there is no scent to it. Like I said before, so there is no scent. The color of course did fade a little bit and to start this was a very subtle neutral color and um, my lips right now feel great. So let's get a makeup wipe. So we can see if there's still product on my lips, which I know there is because I can feel it. I can feel how soft and smooth my lips feel. There we go. There is still lip balm on my lips after five hours, which typically for a lot of lip balms, that doesn't happen. Now, when it comes to the blush, this color didn't work for me though. Like you guys saw it when I was applying my makeup. I started off a little bit because from some of the reviews that I saw, it's very, a little goes a long way. So they suggest that you start off with a little bit and then you can always build it up. And from what I've seen, it is a buildable product just like the lip souffles are, her lipsticks. Those are very buildable. And these are as well, but this color is just not it. This ain't it. This is not gonna do it for me. I started off a little bit, couldn't see anything, and then I continued to build it up, still couldn't see anything. And as you can see, maybe I'm really looking and trying to see if there's something there. I'm really trying 
very hard and there's really not anything and that doesn't mean that the product doesn't do what it's supposed to do it just means that it's the wrong shade for me the color just left the building as a matter of fact the color didn't even show up to the party so but that is my review guys if you guys like this video make sure to go ahead and give me a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe because it does help my channel out a lot it helps me to continue to provide more content for you guys so that you don't have to waste your coins. You guys seem to really enjoy my videos and I do enjoy putting out this content for you. So I really do appreciate all the love and feedback that I get from you guys. And don't forget to turn on your notifications so that you know whenever I post a video. But that's all I got and uh, I will catch you guys in my next swatch video. Bye!